What is going on you Bulgarian Badgers? Today, another car video, it's a quick one. We got some minor changes, minor, especially on the exterior. There's no performance changes or anything like that. Um, but as you guys can see, BMW logo on the back is now in black and white. And it's the carbon fiber one. There's the front. Black and white still. Sort of sort of a bad angle. It's not really clean, guys. I'm sorry. I've killed a lot of bugs and there's been motherfucking tornadoes. Okay, but let's get let's get to the major changes. Get on one knee here. There you guys have it. Brand new steering wheel. As you can see, the stitching is all the same color as this blue. That blue is the same color as my brakes, and my brakes are the same color as the M tricolor up front. So as you guys can tell, everything is matching. Different handbrake, Alcantara. The aluminum trim that I used to have that was there and up there is now carbon fiber. Let me get in the car and give you guys a better look. Oh, so shift knob is also different. Not too sure how I feel about it yet. It's lower down, it's lower down. So you f it feels like better, but it's still like really small. So I don't really know how I feel about it yet. Doesn't light up like my other one does, but that doesn't really matter. It's all really just about the feel to be honest. So, but yeah, carbon fiber there goes all the way up there. That used to be aluminum, but now I just think like, like why? It doesn't make sense. Like my car is pretty mean looking, right? Like if you get a black car, why would you get aluminum trim? So I don't know. So I bought this used, so I didn't spec this car or anything, but it's there, there, wheel. Absolutely love that, guys. That is also same black and white carbon fiber. Oh, and the wheel. So by the way, guys, wheels custom made and basically it's perforated Alcantara. So it's squishy like leather, but feels like Alcantara. So it's really cool. I told them to take this carbon fiber trim off of the BMW, like the official BMW wheel that I have. Um, this wheel, by the way, used to be the leather one and basically the, the leather one that came with the car and they took off the leather and then did the Alcantara. So I no longer have a leather wheel. So if I end up selling the car, some, something's gonna have to take the hit. Uh, I doubt I'm not gonna buy a leather one, so or rebuy a leather one. So, unless you hate the color fucking blue, I'm pretty sure this looks cool. <laughs> okay, so I'm sweating so much. It's 90 degrees out, probably 100% humidity. Uh, this car, actually, by the way, it, I was in a fucking tornado. Literally a tornado. It wasn't actually a tornado, okay? But I was outside. The visibility was probably 10 feet, and it was hailing ping pong balls. Like they they were literally the size of ping pong balls and somehow I was outside for or the car was like outside for maybe 30 seconds thank god and then I got in the car and basically went through a bank drive through but Sasha's okay she hasn't sustained any damage that I've seen so far there's a fucking bug on my camera anyways you guys don't get it twisted okay just because I'm doing car videos doesn't mean I don't want it okay I've been playing probably I don't know I, I would say eight hours a day I would say on average eight hours a day. Yesterday I only played like six, but the day before and the day before that I played 12 each. I've been playing more than I've been sleeping, okay? So don't be like, wow, he, he's doing all this car shit. He doesn't care about COD, like bitch. I said like bitch, I'm trying to perfect the bitch thing to say like Jesse does in, uh, in uh, Breaking Bad, but I can't do it. So anyways, guys, enough of the BS. Let me know if you guys think I should do anything else, something in particular. Um, obviously I can always swap parts out, but I'd really not I don't really want to do that The only thing I can really do left is like a fucking completely absurd stuff like Get bigger turbos or like swap the hood in the trunk for like carbon fiber parts. Let me give you an example, right? If I were to swap that this hood right for the m4 GTS hood it would be like four thousand dollars so there's not really much else to do, guys. So I don't know what I'm gonna do for car videos, but thank you guys for watching. Be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm out for now. 
Uh, today's a double upload day. Tomorrow will also be a double upload day. And uh, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.